just thought I'd take a quick video. So 255 is right there. There's the pool area. And I'm looking around and if I lived here and spent $713 a month, I'd be very proud of this landscaping company. It's beautiful. And the, the buildings look like they've been maintained very nicely. I think if you go through that path right there, there's water back there. I think that's the Stony Creek is back there. Um, but I'm not gonna do that because if there's somebody living there, they're probably gonna be like, what are you doing walking around our yard? Um, right there. I don't know if in the distance you can see the fence to where the tennis center is and the people walking along, the cars going by. That's um, Lighthouse Road right there. And that's the tennis center. So you're, you're that close to Harbor Town, the parking, the bakery, and then of course going over to the marina, the Liberty Oak, Greg Russell, the whole shoot and shebang. People love Harbor Town. Harbor Town is, uh, I don't know if I've ever given you my spiel. I've said it a million times. Sea Pines is, is the flagship community of its kind in the world, developed by Charles Fraser. It was concocted and dreamed of in 1957 and became a reality in the, in the 60s as, as it was built. Charles uh, knew that uh, Sea Pines needed something to be its heart and soul, and that was Harbor Town. I can tell you the whole story of how it was developed or you can um, go online to CH2 Magazine and the May issue, um, my article was published uh, of the development of Harbor Town so you can read that and that's all first-hand knowledge. Charles Fraser's daughter Laura Lawton is my best friend so um, she's my uh, information source and where I get uh, all of the material for, for my historical writings that I do for the magazine. So you can check that out. Um, so all of that, just as an FYI, talk to you soon.